Hi Bruce from Safari and uh, boy do we have something special here. This is a 2014 Ford Ranger Camp King uh, canopy on the back. Look at this beautiful 400 watt solar. We're still putting out solar a few minutes ago. Before we step through what's pretty special about this, look at this beautiful uh, instant hot water. Let's come around and meet the owners here. And uh, this is Michael and Kate. And uh, now Michael, we're gonna step people through it. This is an incredible build that we've got here. Why did you spend so much money on this beautiful Ford Ranger setup? Set we're planning to spend a lot of time off grid, um, but we're also sleeping in a, a rooftop tent. So we really wanted the underfloor heating to make sure that we could get the, the moisture out. And we also wanted the um, electric hot water system. <laughs> Kate, come on, you've got to say something. For me, it was the induction. Yeah. Um, I didn't want to take gas bottles. Um, just don't feel really comfortable with bushfire season and things like that. So the induction is perfect. Just slides out. It's a little easy. And you're voting also for the under mattress heater. Oh, absolutely. For the for the warmth because I yeah. get cold at night. <laughs> but also to dry out the mattress for the mould. Yeah. Potential. So this is actually a world first. What we're doing is we've got our luxury underfloor heater up there. But to control that luxury underfloor heater is this Bluetooth puck. And this Bluetooth puck here measures both temperature and humidity. And they will see that up on the screen here. And I'll just pull it up now. And they will see up here roof uh, top 10 here, 28 degrees C, 56% moisture because we've got it up here. When it's under the mattress, you'll see exactly what the moisture is in the mattress to dry it out. Now let's step through a couple of other things. We've just been running the uh, 6,000 watt uh, instant hot water here. I'll just move this little pillow out of the way here. Look at this baby here. It's on at the moment. It's on setting six here. Uh, wound the temperature up over, I think we're sitting around 42, 44 degrees C. And that's running on that 5,000 watt Victron inverter. Now this is one hell of a setup here. We've got a Scotty at the back there. We were seeing 2200 watts before. I won't turn anything on. Every, everyone's seen Scotty run now. And uh, we've got, uh, what else we got on here? We've got all the power distribution on the other side over there. And then here's the lighting. Now just have a look at this tucked up in the lid. And as I close the lid down, yep, the gas strut switch that you see here that we import from the USA turns that on and off. And on the lights here, what we've got is uh, white and then I can put the amber on. So look at this, amber's back up here now. And again, we close the lid down, and when it gets to a certain position, turns that uh, light off. And then we've got here the uh, uh, driver's light that I'll turn on, which is the steady light on the side there. Look at that, it's intense. And there's a rear light on here as well. So we turn the rear light on, that's the water pump, and the passenger light, and they're way up the top up there. Then on this side over here, we've got rock lights underneath. And these rock lights underneath, you can actually change the color on them. That's just like a blue, you can just see at the moment there. Um, the fridge, of course, and the compressor. And here's the compressor all built in, all wired in here. Puppy up. And she's running away here. And that's the ARB dual compressor. Uh, the side access here, what I like about this is beautiful side access on both sides. There's the Camp King Industries logo. Shout out to them. Beautiful product, guys. Um, I've got to say, I think that's the most compact, luxurious pack that we've done to date. And uh, well done to the team here in building it. And I've got to say, how good's that?